So I technically live in a mansion or So on Justin a uh, live stream Coro BDS he was asked if he was um jealous of Cora new mansion. Do you know that uh, Justin actually said he's not jealous that he's happy that the girls really need to have a place now to play and all that. He, do you know that this guy actually went as far as when people asked him, um, they told him that he's a mansion, like he know already, I, I believe, and according to him, he has been sick, you understand. So he actually went ahead to actually browse and to tell, to prove to us that it was not a mansion, that is not a condo. My darling, even if it is one room that I'm living and it is my own and I find happiness and peace, it's a skyscraper, anything that you like, anything I like, I will call it. You understand? I feel, oh God, have mercy. He even went ahead to even promise 1,000 US dollar to anybody that, in fact, let me allow you guys to watch this today to the end. I love you so very much. Please don't forget to share, like, and subscribe. Down with the flu the last few days. Oh, man, today is the first day I feel like I can get out of bed. It's been, it's been a good one. I don't, I don't think... I don't think I got out of bed yesterday, like at all, except to eat and get water in me. That was a, it was a good time. I don't have a fever today, but I feel like just tired. And I hear it going around, stomach flu and flu, and I just, I, I haven't had the flu in Oh my gosh, when's the last time I had the flu? 2018 was the last time I had the flu that I can recall. But, um, I don't have a fever today. But day. Oh, excuse me, yawning. Seeing someone's house makes me sick. No. No. Why would I, why would I, um, be mad, upset, or jealous about my kids having more room to actually play versus being locked in a bedroom all day? Why would, why would that make me sick? It makes me happy. <coughs> How sick you are. Because ultimately, anything that's good for my daughters is going to make me happy. You guys really need to, like, seek Jesus or something. I'm really toxic. Why would I be upset that my kids have more room to play? Like, like, seriously. Like, that is a very demented just toxic mindset like like you need to like really do some introspection and read a fucking bible or something fuck man Man, some of you guys just really hate me. It's pretty, it's pretty wild. Uh, this is just the beginning, my dear. Soon, I'm, he's going to bleed. Wow. You know, um, anger and hate is associated with heart disease and heart attacks. So, you projecting that kind of information, that kind of energy into the world, you're killing yourself faster. So I highly, I highly suggest that you get that under control because I'm sure your loved ones would like you to live a long, happy life, you know. So I took a shower while you guys were arguing over the bear and some of you were, and, and, and some of you were being positive. Um, I just see a lot of negativity here. It was the first shower I've taken in 48 hours because I've just been stuck in bed. I just kind of show it. Man, there's a lot of, like, just 
really toxic people in here. It's crazy. Would I be upset <clears throat> about my kids having more room and then not being locked in a single bedroom all day? Why would I not be upset? Why would I be upset that they have more room to, ex to roam? Seriously, people are... Your mind is sick. Seriously, if you have that, if you actually think that I would have that thought process, your mind, like, is sick. But it's fixable, most likely. Condo versus mansion. Everyone's talking about a mansion. So let's define what a mansion is. What is... How, how many square feet do we consider a mansion? Let's, let's, let's attack this from an educational standpoint, because a lot of you are just throwing random things out on the internet, and, and it, your, your ignorance is showing. Right. And I think one of the things that I have a pet peeve about the most about humans and mankind is people that have strong opinions based on nothing but their opinion. Why is my internet not working well in here? Let's go into my office and see if it works better in there. I think I need to get another <coughs> extender. It doesn't look like two is enough. of a mansion is a home that it offers at least 5,000 square feet, uh, and it has at least five to six bedroom. Okay, so mansions typically sit on small acreage. Okay, so how many square feet are condos? two-bedroom condo is 700 feet to 750 feet to 1,000 square feet. So that means that a condo is one-fifth of a mansion. My home is 3,000 square feet, so I'm 2,000 square feet short of a mansion. But if you add in my unit and the unit below, that's 6,000 square feet. So I technically live in a mansion or half of one. If you put both of these together, my home is considered a mansion, but they're, they're separate. They're separate living quarters, so I don't live in a mansion. Since so many people are saying words and just putting out phrases on the internet with, um, with complete inaccuracy and, and borderline, not even borderline, ignorance. Humans, we need to be better. I'm a little bit more s s snarky right now because I'm getting over a fever, but... I will give you $1,000 if you show me evidence of my children being locked in a room. $1,000. Email it to me, post it in the comments. If you find evidence of my children being locked in a room, I will give you $1,000. It'll be transferred to your account in any way that you like, or I can pay you cash if you live in LA. So, people are just, your toxicity is just, uh, it's just crazy. 
Got a bunch of parrots on here that are just repeating things that they say without actually thinking about it. Maybe, 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 maybe that'll be my next pet as a parrot. That I'm a devil. That's pretty funny. Some seriously toxic cells on here. Mm. Mm. All right. No. 